not one, not two, but three different Taylor Swift cardigans. Hey guys, welcome back to another video. It's been a long time since I've been here, <laughs> since y'all have seen me. Um, I am obviously home for the holidays, <laughs> which means it is time for my Christmas haul 2023. I was actually trying to think the other day, when's the last time I did one of these? And I think it was 2021, maybe I'm just forgetting. But let's get on with it. Um, the lighting right here is so beautiful. <laughs> anyway, I had such a good Christmas this year. I have been in college for the past year and I there's just like a few things they needed. They're not really like needs, they're more like wants, but so this year was kind of like filling in a lot of that, but let's get right on. This year for me was a shoe year. I got so many pairs of shoes because the style of like, shoes are like really important to your style, I feel like. And I have kind of put off like my shoe style for so long. I just wear like white Converse. And this year I was like, no, I'm. we're gonna get into like low tops. We're gonna find cute shoes. So these are the first pair that I love. I think they're so cute. I'll probably wear those today. And then I got these platform Mary Janes that are cream because I have the black ones and I love them, but not every outfit is like a, like you need a black shoe. So I got something more neutral that I think is freaking adorable. Hello. And then the last pair of shoes I got was from Bailey. And she got me these Uggs and they she put bows on the back, which are just, I mean, come on. Anything with a bow on it is like perfect. But these are just so freaking cute and they're soft and I'm obsessed with them. Like not even a joke. I love them. <laughs> and then I got some clothes, some various clothes items, um, clothing items. The first one is this black long sleeve gym shirt. I've been going to the gym a lot in the past year and it's like gets really cold in the winter in Utah and I just need something that's a little warmer. I'm also running a half marathon for and why, I don't know, but in March, in March in Utah is cold. So I need some stuff that's gonna keep me warm. And I'll stumble on it, which is such a win. And then the other thing I got were two pairs of just biker shorts. They're my four inch, they're favorites. They have no front seam and then a side pocket for your phone. I just needed, like, I feel like I needed some new colors. So I was getting a little bored. So I'm glad I have these. And I'm pretty sure these are just from Amazon. So like you could get them, I'm sure. And then this is not open, but it's just a gray zip up hoodie. Another gym fit. That's just it's like i need everyone wears like a gray zip up with like sweatpants and i just have needed one so i just put that on my christmas list and then the holy trinity don't look literally the best thing i got this christmas for sure hands down are not one not two but three different taylor swift cardigans so this is the speak now obviously it says that here and these are all like authentic and real. And then we have red, which has stars on the elbows. And then we have the newest one, 1989. Come on, so freaking cute. If you're a Swifty, you'll know that these are kind of collectible. Like they're, they're pretty hard to find. Um, the story behind it is just like Taylor released a folklore cardigan when she released folklore, it was in the merch and it just like sold out like crazy. And then she dropped two holiday ones and they sold out like crazy. And then now it's just kind of like the cardigans are like collectibles. And so they just sell out like crazy and resell for an insane amount. So somehow my mom got her hands on three. I have had none before this and now I have to collect them, which I'm so excited. I'm going to be on the hunt. I'm on the lookout. So excited. The next thing I got is this Sol de Janeiro. I don't know if I'm saying that correctly, but it's number 62. This smells like heaven in a bottle, I'm gonna be honest. I love it. I put some on yesterday and I was like, yeah. 
Mm, it just smells so good. And it's like just this tiny, well, not like tiny, but this little bottle. It's so nice. I love it. Mm, it just smells so good. Okay. It's also so cute. Like, it's like a little disco ball. Then my dad, we used to grow up playing games on this like MacBook. Well, it probably wasn't even a MacBook. I don't even know what it was, but it was like a desk, desktop, com de oh my gosh, desktop computer. And um, we used to play these like CD games, these, yeah. And I'm so confused on how to say this, but basically Apple came out with like a new CD reader. So my dad got us all one of those. And then he got the games for us because we talk about them all the time. And so he got us each like three games and mine came with like a little book. So that's like the cutest thing ever because those were like my childhood. We used to play those games all the time. It's like I Spy, Reader Rabbit, like only a few, there's only like a few other people in the world I've met that have also played those games growing up and they're so good. They're actually just so good. I love it. And then obviously, as you know, every year we get our C's candies in our life and I just, my babies, <laughs> I have no had life in like a year, actually. So I'm glad I have some now. And then my mom, she got us these new, it's like super like clean laundry detergent. I'm really excited to try them. But basically it's like, I think, I think it's uh, essential oil, like scent. It actually smells just like splittery so good, but yeah, I don't know. These are dryer sheets and these are like tablets and I've heard really good things about them. And I'm also almost out of laundry detergent, so I'm excited to try that. Then we did a bunch of sibling gifts this year and I've already gone, gone through some of them, but Camry got me this, which is a bag that you put your film camera in and that way you can go through TSA because I love my film camera, but I was just kind of sending it through and hoping it wouldn't ruin the film. I had no idea like what you were really supposed to do with it, so. Now I have that, that's actually super useful. I'm glad I got that. And then Brooklyn got me, well, all of us, one of these. This is a passport, like, cover. And it's like Stony Clover type thing. I don't know if you can tell. That's R, that's my name, Rylan. Um, it's literally so cute. And I actually just got my passport redone, so perfect. And then she got me this, which is like, kind of like one of those gag gifts, but also not. Basically the story behind this is that YouTube gives out play buttons when you hit like a million or whatever. I think it's like a hundred thousand or a million. And so almost all the people in my family have like two or three play buttons and they're like kind of hung up in my, like in our offices and stuff. So that's like so fun for them, but I never did YouTube. So <laughs> I don't have any flags, but I did just hit half a million on TikTok and TikTok doesn't do buttons or plaques. And so Brooklyn had one made that says like, presented to Rylan Olivia McKnight for passing half a million followers on TikTok, which is actually so sweet. Like that's so thoughtful. Like I would never would have thought to like have something like this, but yeah, so cute. I love it. And yeah, I'm really proud of having half a million. So that's insane. Uh, go follow if you're watching this. <laughs> Let's get to a million. <laughs> anyway. Then Dax and Pace got me two different gifts, but they're kind of low-key the same. This one is car LED lights. And then Paisley got me this like R that has LED lights. So I have just like a bunch of different like color options. And yeah, this is just, just so cute. I'll put these in my car, I'll put this in my room. It'll be perfect. I like love them. So thoughtful of them. And then my dad, my dad did the stockings this year. And he got me, well, he got us, he got me these like s'mores clusters. I've never actually tried these, but I heard they're good. So taking his word for it. And then some like, these are actually my favorite. I, I, I love these. Um, pretzel crisp, dark chocolate peppermint. And this is coveted, a giant bag of beef jerky. If you know my dad, you know he makes beef jerky and it's so freaking good. And like I'll eat all of this in like a day. So he gave me my whole own huge bag, which I still will probably eat in the entire day. And then, um, bless his heart, but I don't drink soda. And every year we've gotten like a little soda, like our favorite sodas in our stockings. 
and I don't drink soda, so every year I've kind of gotten like lemonade or like something super different. And I think he went to Trader Joe's and saw this was like pink lemonade, which would have been perfect and it is perfect, but it is definitely sparkling pink lemonade. And the reason I don't drink soda is because I don't like carbonation. So <laughs> kinda, kinda didn't work, but still so cute. I mean, come on, maybe I'll try it and see if I like it better, but I don't think that probably will happen. But he tried, that's all that matters. And then, I got this Eno. I have a one person Eno and I love it, but every time I go out with my friends and we go hammocking, I just like, it, it, I don't know. There's just like not enough space for both of us in the hammock and then it's like small. And so I just figured I'd rather have a two person and then I can one person in a two person and then I can two person in a two person, you know what I mean? So yeah, and now I have both. So it worked perfect. I can take my one person out, they can use a little person. <laughs> Three of us can go, basically, is what I'm trying to get at. Anyway, it's so cute. It's like tan, or tan, teal and gray, and I think purple, which I think is cute. And then the last gift is from Dakota. He got me this 1989 crew neck, which I just think is darling. I obviously, huge Swifty, and so anything that has Taylor Swift on it to do with Taylor Swift, anything like that, it's gonna be perfect. So that is my Christmas haul this year, which is perfect. And this is my first year flying home for Christmas and my first year flying back home after Christmas. So I don't know really how I'm gonna fly this off, <laughs> but we'll figure it out. It will be, it'll be perfect. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. Uh, sorry if it was like a little boring, it's just my Christmas haul, but I'm so thankful, I'm so grateful, and I'm so happy that I got the things I did, especially the cardigans. I know they're kind of hard to come by, so I love that I have not one, not two, but three now. I'm going to wear those every single day. But thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this. And I'll see you later. I think. Maybe. Hopefully. <laughs> I don't know. I'll see you soon. Hopefully not in a year. Isn't this how it's supposed to be? Making our Christmas memories.